Hi guys and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. So after that talk, um, I guess we can skip the druid. I don't know, I can't find him, so... And we don't need him really, so maybe we can skip him? Let's see, maybe is there something, can we do something here? I would like to find him, but I don't know where. Maybe I ran past him two or three times and didn't find him, I don't know. But yeah, I can't seem to find him, so I guess we will go back. There's probably some more goblins around. Um, so where do we have to go? Blighted village. Oh yeah. Environs? There's probably a, a fast travel place in here that I didn't find. Find the Gijaki patrol. It's back there. And here, rescue the druid. It's still here. Yeah, but it doesn't discover the artifact secrets, embrace your potential, find a cure. Um, yeah, it doesn't even show up anymore here. So, maybe that's not a thing anymore. Then let's get back to the village. How do we get there? Um, to the grove, I mean, not the village. Let's just keep going this way. Devout wasp. What is this? Did we go through here? I don't think so. They are all empty, so maybe we, we did. Oh yeah, this was the entrance to the camp, right? There's the bridge? Yeah, here's the bridge. What is over here? Some cave. And another way up there. Let's look at the map. So it's this place here, and there's some stuff over there. But yeah, I guess let's let's go back to the grove and tell the refugees that they can go home, uh, that they can go to Baldur's Gate. So we will have to go through the village again. Let's see if the goblins are aggro now. Where does this go? Hmm, there's a way to go through here without going through the village. Oh, there's some big guys up here. Um, so maybe we could go around the village through through here. Without fighting all of those guys. But let's see. Let's see if they are aggro. There's the first guy up there. So let's throw down a safe before we go into there. And now let's see what happens. Well, it doesn't seem to be aggressive. Okay. Moss covered chest. There was something funny happening up here, I, I guess. They were throwing stones at the guy hanging here from the... Oh, 
I can't see the guy, but they are supposedly... There he is. What's that? Goblin devout. Well, let's first go back to the grove and tell the refugees they can go home. But I suppose they will be going through this village. Maybe it's not even that good of an idea. Oh, there's a lot of dead goblins over there that we didn't loot. Didn't we go through here? Maybe not. Oh yeah, and there was would be the path through the forest, I guess. Let's loot all of these. Oh, it's just this one. Goblins drawing. Examine. Oh, okay. We can't. So take all, and now can we open it? Read. Drawn in thick charcoal lines upon an animal skin, this childlike portrait depicts three stick figures, a goblin with sparks in his hands, a square humanoid figure, and what seems to be an elf. Each of them is wearing a simple crown. Hmm. Defeat the goblins. What? Defeat the goblins? With priestess gut defeated, the goblins have no leadership. They won't be a threat now. We should tell the tieflings. Yeah, we know that. Speak with Zevlor. Here, right? Yeah, talk to Zevlor. Okay. So that was just an update on the same quest. These chests are all empty. Oh, there's the boar he, he ate. Or drunk. Um, that was the exit of that cave we went in, right? I don't know, but we have to go this way. Let's keep going. Oh, these are um, like rune symbols from the druids, I guess. Probably to protect their place. Yeah, there's more over there. Will they let us in now that we killed all the goblins? Um, hello? Can we talk to you? Yeah, she opened the door. Nice. So to go out it was harder. Maybe we should have just approached the gate also. Oh, they are already all already. Seems that they are all ready to go. Okay. just reported. The goblins' leadership has been decimated. We might escape this place yet. And I hear you are the one to thank. I'm grateful. I took a collection from all of us. It isn't much, but you've earned it. Okay, thank you. It's not enough, but it's all we have. Halsin will likely want to thank you too, mind. He returned. Oh, just okay. Ago. I believe he's catching up with Corker. As for us. No armies at our heels. Amazing. We can finally leave. So or perhaps we need not speak of farewells. We'll join your camp tonight to celebrate if you'll have us. We'll see you there. Okay, nice. So next time we rest, they will be there. They will be there, I guess. Oh, that's a lot of them. Um, so we could have looked for quite some time and didn't find him. I guess because he's here already. Yeah. Okay. So, could have told me that before. But I guess that's why the quest disappeared. But the marker was still there, so... Yeah, I don't know. We should buy and sell stuff. Especially sell stuff. Where is the next store? 
There was one down here, I think. This is a store, right? Oh, not here anymore? That's bad. I wanted to sell all my trash. All those old weapons and stuff. Took it upon yourself to undertake the right of thorns. I ought to exile you from this place forever. Instead, I shall listen to the explanation that you owe me. I owe you nothing. Goblins swarmed us like roaches while you stumbled after the past. You chose to abandon us. I chose to protect us. Silence. The right has been ended. I will allow you to stay. But consider yourself a novice anew. You have forgotten the ways of the druids, our place in the natural order. You shall learn it all once again, right here. Backslide, and nature's fury will crush you. As you wish, Master Helsin. You'll have your hands full with her. She shows great spirit, to put it mildly. She shows great insolence. But time will humble her. And the grove still needs her. You will soon see why. But enough of that for now. I owe you my thanks. The grove stands. Nature prevails. I owe you my thanks. And an introduction. I am Halsin, first druid of the Emerald Grove. And I sense you have a problem you seek my help with. Yes, I have a mind flayer parasite inside my head. I want your help to remove it. It's true. I can feel it right now. Oh, Oak Father, preserve you, child. But something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the Absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? Um... I don't know. Someone is using very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic. I can't cure you. But that doesn't mean I can't help. At the goblin camp, I hoped to find a way to remove the tadpoles. I failed, but I did find the next best thing. I found out where they come from. I will do what I can to help you. Let us speak tomorrow. You and I both have matters to see to first. As for what you've done for the Grove, speak to Wrath. He will see to your reward. Okay, reward is good. What happens next? The journey to Moonrise Towers. And all the dangers that that entails. Okay. But that's tomorrow's problem. Take some time for yourself tonight. Rest. Celebrate. Come morning, I'll be by your side. So, does this mean I was supposed to do all of this in one day? Maybe. Um, save the refugees. Grateful for our help. The tieflings are celebrating our victory. Time to have some fun. Okay. Halsin thanked us and said that Wrath would surely reward, uh, reward us for our efforts. Halsin said that we are in no immediate danger and that answers are at Moonrise Towers. We can celebrate tonight and discuss a plan in the morning. Explore the Underdark. The Underdark is a twisted labyrinth of tunnels and ruins. To find the path to Moonrise Towers we will need to explore. Halsin said that the illiterate parasites had been altered by followers of the Absolute. 
If we want answers, we need to head to the cold space at Moonrise Towers. The Underdark. That sounds like an um, Warhammer 3 um, Total War. There's like the Underdark also, or the Underpads, or something like that, where the tunnels are. Hmm. So these are completed. Why? Hide complete. Okay. Save the refugees, embrace your potential. So first we have a party. A party and we have to talk to whom? Um, oh, there's a door here. Is this, this is like an elevator. Where does this go? Huh. I guess we will find out later. Um, who do we have to talk to for our reward? Um, what's that? Pintiaki Patrol? Oh, we should go to that also. Goblin Camp. There's a up arrow. Um, where is the guy that will give us our reward? Bosk, Ilar, Halsen, Envy, and Tahan. None of these. Um, Wrath. Okay, let's look for this Wrath guy. Oh wait, maybe it's one of those that were inside? Inside here? Let's go inside here and see. That's the case. Jorna, that's not Wrath. Apicus, that's also not the Wrath. Kaga. Wrath, this guy. You've done it. You brought House in back. Thank you. No, thanks is not enough. May Sylvanus bless you for all your days. Okay. I cannot imagine taking on a camp full of goblins was a simple task. And some gold? Um. Think nothing of it. I'm glad Holzen is safe. As am I. The grove will be whole again. Let me show you on your map where you can find the cash. Take this rune. You'll need it. The cash? Place it among the pedestals inside our library. When the wolf glows brightest, everything in the vault below will be yours. Um, who's this? Oh, Shadowheart wants to talk. I don't think there'll be any more trouble between Lazelle and I, if you were wondering. We can all sleep easier now. Well, apart from all the rest. That's good. I'd rather keep f things friendly between all of us. You have an interesting definition of friendly, but yes. That artifact seems to be protecting us somehow. Do we still have it? Quite the understatement, but yes, I have it, and I'll guard it with my life. Okay. Um, leave. So he marked the map. Here, this thing, maybe? Vault entrance, yeah, looks like it. Okay, so let's get going to there. We can... Loot their vault. What's happening? Oh, it immediately opened? A parasite brimming with magic. Take it. Oh, here? Mind flayer parasite specimen. 
Hastily written note. I entrust you with the circlet to open the library. Wear it always. If you need to enter the vault, talk to Rath. He has the rune, but won't give it to anyone. So be sure you have good reason to ask. Protect my research while I'm gone and take care of the animals. Don't give fish to Tuffet. She's getting lazy. Okay. So we have another parasite. Journals, note on draw, dagger, that's stealing. Rune of the Eagle, empty socket. So let's put that in the socket, I guess. What's that? Um, yeah. This rune, I guess. And combine. Okay. What now? Wolf, elk, bear, and eagle. Well, well. What have we okay, that was easy enough. It's a lot of stuff here. Maybe some interesting books also. But first, let's go loot there. What's this? This is also a hidden place. Stone door. Okay, maybe that's the way to the underdark for next time. But first, let's loot their vault. Um, nothing much, it seems. Something good here, I hope. Okay, not really much to get here. What's this? Robe of Summer. Brands resistant to cold. Jade and some cash, okay. So these are their sacred things, I guess. Sorrow. Fluid note. Sorrow, 1 to 10. Sorrowful lash, transmutation cantrip. Target can't be pulled if it's huge in size. Okay. And what else? Those attacks. I have proficiency, I think, with... What is this? This is a glaive. Glaives, yeah. So I can use this. Um... Yeah, 1 to 10. Okay, let's use this. Nice. And this... Uncommon clothing. Can we use this here? No. Grants resistance to cold. And we have rare light armor. Okay. Maybe not. What does he use? Is that clothing? Added armor? 11? It has nothing special, right? Yeah, she has... Heavy armor. And she has... Medium armor. So only him. He is using light armor. No one back home will ever believe this. Um let's see. Keep a blade close. Ten and resistance to cold damage, that one is eleven. So yeah, let's change that. Oh, looks good on him. Okay. Certainly. Nothing there. Nothing there. These are all empty, it seems. Okay, anything? Secret societies of the Sword Coast exposed. The most well known of the Sword Coast cabals, perhaps, but certainly not benign. In its enshrouded doings, my sources claim that those belonging to this mysterious faction abhor power, but if that is so, why do they not expose the, re the revelations of their inquiries for the public good? Why indeed? Because knowledge is the power and the harpers intend to keep both for themselves. Shadow Druids? 
the Order of Chlor, the last, least known and accordingly most dangerous of the secret societies I have researched is the Order of Chlor. 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 My sources tell me this shadowy conspiracy of murders, mutilators and tyrants regularly meet to plan the demise of any number of innocent citizens of our fine land. What's more, they like it. Dark Justiciars. I shrather when even to inscribe I shrather even to inscribe their name upon the purity of this page. I shall leave it at this. They worship Shar. Oh, Dark Justicius worship Shar. So Shar is that bad? I don't know who Shar is. There should be like an encyclopedia or something for one to learn all of that. Yeah, and these special spells we should teach them to our um, mage. Oh, Wyvern Toxin, we have one of those. Antidote, Serpent Fang Toxin, and Elixir of Poison Resistance. Okay. Potion of Mind Reading, Elixir of Fire Resistance, Potion of Greater Healing, 4d4 plus 4, okay, and Potion of Animal Speaking, that can be interesting, and there's nothing else here, right? Looks like it, okay, so we got some nice items, um... Can she learn magic? Spellbook. Reactions, common, and cleric. Can she learn them somehow? Let's see, does she have some scrolls? She has one here. Scroll of Blur. Um, doesn't look like it. Or how do they learn? Maybe Gale can learn them. Okay, it's so let's go back. Let's go Got back into on. the village. I guess we go upstairs. Who's that? Oh, Netty. Okay. Yeah, let's go upstairs. Oh, these statues were the ones that were down in that cave also that attacked us. I guess... Do we camp here in the inner grove? Mm, probably not. Probably that's not... Not good manners, I would say. I need a shop. I think the shop is with the refugees now. But I don't know if I can sell stuff that I have in the camp. I would like to sell some stuff from the camp. Is there no store in here? Oh, there's another door down there. Oh, here's a store. Worth talking to, perhaps. You saved us. I wasn't sure we'd make it through. Let me see your wares. I wish I had better, but this is all I have. Can I sell from the camp all? Equipment, books and keys, consumables, magical, miscellaneous. No, I can't. Damn it. Yeah, I can't sell from the camp, so I should only put... I should probably only put, um... good things in camp, and the rest I should take to sell, maybe. 
Hmm, that's a shame. Okay. Shame. Don't know where this goes. Stone door. Secluded chamber. Okay, this is just invasion plans for Eltorgard. What are invasions plans for Eltorgard? And why are they here? Eltorgard. Further from Baldur's Gate than I'd hoped. An aging map. Goblins marked on the map. Travel won't be easy. An aging map of Eltorgard and its surroundings. The cities of Baldur's Gate and Elturel are both marked. But it's the wilderness in between that's covered in notes, symbols and ciphers. The freshest ink marks, pictographs of goblins and gnolls show shown gathering in the forest and hills nearby. Okay, so this is like a a strategy room, I guess. <clears throat> like where they do the war council or something like that. If there is something like that. So let's get to our new friends over here. Can we loot all, all their stuff? We could. And they wouldn't even be bad at us. Okay. Do they have anything good? Let's move. Yeah, no one will will be mad at us for this. Okay. Whoops. I guess if they don't mind. I won't mind either. <laughs> Is there any supplies for camping? What's up here? Only kids? They have a lot of kids. Not so many adults. Okay, so let's go to the party and see what's going on there. Oh. <laughs> the party is actually in our camp. What is this? This is the traveler's chest. Is this where all the stuff goes? Uh. Oh, Gale is the one that takes care of the chest, I guess? Yeah, here's where all the stuff goes. Damn it. Um. What happens if... If I mark these... Like, if I mark all of this as wares. Pick up and add to wares. Okay, I get over encumbered. Blood. No, never mind. And it's all marked as wares. So if I go to a shop, then I can sell this immediately, I guess. Okay. But it's way too much stuff, so it has to go back to camp. Okay, this can go back to camp also. This too. And I guess that's it. Can't I put these in there? Edge together sack. What's in here? Oh, okay. Okay, does she have something on her head? Whatever it takes. Just a circlet. Right. Wait, I didn't know we had this. Um Open. Take all. Okay. Now this is just a patch together sack. Drop item. This will go to her. And she heals someone else, she gets healed herself also. Uh, 
Uh, what? What's this? Oh, that's all the headgear I have? Okay. Um... So, let's see. Who wants to talk? He wants to talk. He probably finds this quite interesting because he was is going to have a lot of food. I never pictured myself as a hero. Never thought I'd be the one they'd toast for saving so many lives. And now that I'm here... <laughs> I hate it. This is awful. Really? Saving lives is awful? We killed some goblins to save some tieflings. The tally of lives didn't change much. But what do I get for all my hard work? A pat on the head and vinegar for wine. Winge all you want. I'm having fun. <laughs> By all means, go and enjoy yourself. I'll be here, waiting for the sunrise. Okay. Um, why did I get over there? On my way. What do you have Hope to you say? Join the night, hero. I certainly am. Cheers to many more like this. Okay, this was the friendly one. Just. A what did he say? I should be out there. What? You have no idea how good it feels to see these people smiling. The singing we could probably do without, <laughs> but even so, thank you. Okay. That's my girl. Who is back here? Mall. It's like a kid? Yeah, I guess so. Only five hit points. Who is this? Alfira. This might be the wine talking, but I'm feeling inspired. Thinking of writing my next song about you. These thieflings are quite colorful. An angle. Not the only ideas? from the skin. Um. Have you seen this body? I would. It would be a crime not to sing about it. One raunchy ballad coming up. <laughs> okay. One raunchy ballad. Okay, anything go going down here? Whose tent will this be? Is there anything over here that we can explore? No, it doesn't look like it. Maybe there's some th secrets to find in here. There's a bucket. This guy enjoying himself. Fate spins along as it should. Okay. Does thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection? Can I sell instead? stuff to you? Um Change my class one hundred. One hundred what gold? Okay. Guex, this guy is all alone here in the corner. Is he not having fun? Look at them all. Guzzling poison like we've the right to be happy. We survived. That's always worth celebrating. Not everyone. We lost people and it's like they don't even care. <clears throat> but I care. And I won't trick myself into a stupor to change that. Okay, so not everyone is happy with the party. Is this everyone? Our numbers have grown so Okay, I guess that's it. That was I didn't talk to everyone, but most of them don't seem to have much to say. Okay, go to bed. Maybe there's a little cutscene or something. Don't we have enough other stuff? Yeah, we have a lot. Um, 
Okay, auto select. Full rest. Buzz of celebration quiets to a soothing hum as you approach your bunk. You've picked up a few pleasant memories on your journey amongst your struggles. Go to bed alone. Oh! Okay, so there could have been another option here, I guess. You sleep alone, uplifted by memories of your recent triumphs. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. I trust you enjoyed your evening. After all your efforts, it was well deserved. It may be some time before you're afforded another such night. There is much to be done, and I promised I would help you however I could. I'm certain a cure for you can be found at Moonrise Towers, but it's complicated. The journey specifically, it's extremely perilous, though it seems you're well accustomed to navigating danger. What's so dangerous about it? To get to the towers, you'll need to pass through a terrible place, a cursed place. This curse shrouds everything in shadow. You will not find life, light, or anything natural there. Any who linger are twisted by the curse. They become shadow beings, tormented, dangerous souls. What do you suggest? You could go overland. Along the Risen Road or through the mountains. Easier at first, but you'll run into the Shadow Curse eventually. You could also go under. There is a tunnel somewhere in the ruined Temple of Saluna. It leads to Moonrise long ago. A man called Ketherick Thurman built a secret stronghold deep down there. Before rallying a whole army of Dark Justicias. Shah worshippers. Dark Justicias? I must see for myself. Aridan and his lot were looking for a way down there. They were promised riches if they retrieved a relic called the Night Song. But I think there's more. From this stronghold, Ketherick's forces could access both the Temple of Saluna and Moonrise Towers. But he was defeated before he could launch an attack. If you can find this place, I'll wager it will reveal a more direct path to Moonrise Towers. And maybe even bypass the worst of the Shadow Curse. Yeah, I was going to say, it's probably that uh, that place we found down there. I found the hidden entrance in the Temple of Saloon. The way is clear. Already? <laughs> if only I'd gone with you instead of Aradin. I would like to join your camp, if you'll allow me. I can offer my skills, my counsel. I've long sought to return to Moonrise Towers. It seems our fates have aligned. Okay, so we get a druid now? What about the grove? I've chosen a successor as first druid, Francesca of the High Forest. A bird's already been dispatched to summon her. I'll trust your judgment. I'm glad you approve. I do not truly care if you approve, but I am glad. <laughs> okay. The world needs to move beyond the mistakes of the past. What it needs is an unknown quantity. An outsider who can enforce the Oak Father's teachings without bias. This is why I chose Francesca. She will restore simplicity and purity to the grove in my absence. Sounds like the grove will be in good hands then. We should get going. Indeed. We've quite the journey ahead of us. Okay. So I guess we have a new character now. This guy. What can he do? Um Not this. I'm curious to see what a druid can do. 
But we will find that out next time, I guess. Because for now I'm going to make a cut. And we'll see you guys. Hopefully we'll see you guys in the next episode. So, hope you enjoyed. Come back for more and see you soon. Bye.